All right, how's everybody doing? It is Friday, thank goodness, not that it matters. Be working over the weekend uh, and this business doesn't stop. So a uh, quick thing here, I just got a call from, from another client, past client that we did business with and he was asking me about short-term interest rates um, and that the Fed was, was increasing the, the rates again and do we still have the same prognosis as going forward, you know, we feel once they announce the, the recession over time, when that happens, I think we're in a recession right now, but when the, the government officially, officially, officially announces it, the rates are gonna start trickling down. Um, and all indicators are pointing to around five, you know, somewhere in the low fives, okay? It could be a high fours, but probably low fives. No guarantees on that, have to say that, uh, but when you look at the charts from over the years, anytime that there, that there was a recession, rates have always come down. So. Uh, so his question was, well, you know, do you still keep that same, you know, same mindset or same theory that, you know, with the Fed increasing the rates again by a quarter coming up and, and all that, um, does that still affect your, your um, prognosis? And I said, basically, no, it actually helps because anytime the Fed um, increases the, the rates, that's on short term interest rates. That's from bank to bank lending. And the offspring of that is HELOCs, car loans, credit cards and so forth. Anytime they do that over time, that slows down inflation. Inflation is the arch enemy of long-term mortgage rates. So when that happens, rates start coming down. Okay, so this it's it's you know it's you know it's frustrating to a point because you know this happens um, a lot. You know with, with you know especially the last year or so with the Fed raising the rates, and people automatically assume that to mortgage rates. Not just saying people in general. I'm talking about newscasters and so forth. It kind of just blows me away that they don't understand economics 101 and, and they, they just, you know, say this stuff, spout it off and people take it and, and you know, run with it. So uh, just to be aware, I've said this before on many live videos before, when the Fed raises short term interest rates, OK, the intention is to eventually slow down inflation, which in turn helps long term interest rates come down. OK, so. Uh, one really has nothing to do with the other one. It, it somewhat does because eventually that will attack the arch enemy of long-term interest rates, which is inflation. So hopefully that helps clears things up. If you got any, any questions on that, let me know. Uh, shoot me, you know, shoot me a private message, text me at 423-251-8083 and uh, we can jump on it right away for you. Okay. Have a great weekend. Talk to you guys soon.